there, 100% raw. When I switched to raw food from a meat eater's diet, I was able to speed up my workouts radically. My recovery improved a lot quicker. And this allowed me to have more energy and dynamics. I used to think that there was no possible way that I could ever build any kind of muscle or have any kind of tissue or, or, or be any kind of athlete if I didn't eat meat and chicken and fish and beef and all sorts of things that walked on four legs. As that's evolved now, I'm here in the state that I've been doing this now for over a decade. Uh, won titles in um, national titles in bodybuilding, no chemicals, no drugs, none of that stuff, and went to the world championships and had a lot of wonderful experiences. I, I was able to do that not because I was eating meat, because I wasn't. In fact, it was easier, faster, simpler, more fun, and healthier. So let's go through a routine of what Wade does every day. First thing in the morning, he starts with a glass of water. We're 75% water, so the first thing I do in the morning is I want to get all my body is hydrated because we worry about toxins, we worry about chemicals. And I have a little saying, I go, the solution to pollution is dilution. If you look at the longest living, healthiest populations in the world, they all live high up in the mountains and they drink glacier runoff water. And the Japanese have, have created a way that we can turn regular tap water into as close approximation as possible as that glacier runoff milk that these long living, healthy, vibrant populations are used to drinking. And the cool thing is you just set up, once you have the machine set up, you just turn on the water, right, we press the button, and I'm able to adjust the pH. I'm actually able to make five different types of water here. I mean, I make water that'll clean all the oil-based pesticides that may have gotten onto my food. I've got water that can disinfect. I got water that I can put on my beauty skin for my skin to make my skin nice. And I have at least one of these jars before I go out and, and do my exercise in my morning. We're creating a massive antioxidant. Vitamin C, for example, really, really good vitamin C might be minus 50 or minus 100. And now we're able to get an electrical based antioxidant of around minus 300 right here. So what happens is, if you remember when we had all those little swirling electrons, that little cloudiness inside there, I'm pouring that inside my body and not like a, an electron that I get from a food where it's got to be broken down into an ash and take the free radicals. This way I can deliver the electron right into the cell. Now one of the key reasons of why I was able to train faster, harder, and longer than other people on probably less food and that sort of thing is because I was putting so much antioxidant power based on this technology into my body that was flushing out all the damage that I was doing from exercise.